in the steely silence of an urban landscape. A trumpet sounds for Canada's one and only. We simply can't say enough about Oscar Peterson's contribution to Canadian culture, Canadian music. That man, he was a hero of this country. A hero to Jens Lindemann, world-renowned trumpet virtuoso and member of the Order of Canada. Jens is also a jazz man, fueled by the enduring musical gifts of Canada's king. I've had a fascination with the Canadiana Suite since I was a kid. So from the earliest time that I grew up listening to those movements and being inspired by that music, I've had this fascination with the piece. I mean, this is like the, the musical Bible. Fascination turned to fire during a visit with 93-year-old Phil Nimmons. You're holding a piece of living history. Yeah. A legendary musician, composer, and teacher. They simply call him the dean, as in the dean of all music, the dean of all education. Phil's also a lifelong friend to Oscar Peterson. I can't help but miss him in many ways. There are a lot of things hanging around in my house <laughs> that remind me of O.P. These are Oscar's hand markings. Yeah. Among them, an original score of the Canadiana Suite, not the version made famous by Oscar's trio, but another, composed and orchestrated by Phil Nimmons for Big Band in 1970. I said, what do you mean you orchestrated it? He said, well, I've got the parts right here in my basement. He was stunned. You know, and that's hard to do with Jens. <laughs> I was hit with a bolt of lightning. I knew we had to do this piece. Hey, yeah. Jens would call on Canadian jazz royalty to form a band. They are a national treasure in our country. Legends who played with Oscar Peterson. The same thing there. All members of the Order of Canada. We're talking about a group of stars whose average age is 78. Soloists would play Oscar's melody. The Yamaha Big Band with members from Newfoundland to BC sharing the stage. So we covered the entire nation with this group. Another four musicians took turns on the keys. And of course the explanation to the audience was, it takes four piano players to make one Oscar Peterson. Staged at the Royal Conservatory's prestigious Kerner Hall, the group would play to a sold-out house. The performance coined Sweet Canadiana and nominated for a Juno. The whole energy level went through the roof and the audience went crazy. This was living history and it was ours, Canadian history. So here is this piece of music that's getting a new life and I'm very grateful for that. And I think Canada should be too. And the two friends who gave the nation this gift on Oscar's behalf just wish he'd been here to help them unwrap it. And would he have loved this concert? Oh, I think so. Well, yeah. If he wouldn't, I would have straightened him out. <laughs> I think he would have loved it. There's no way he would have been sitting in the audience, though. He would have jumped on stage and say, that was a great version. Now let me show you how it really goes. For Regional Contact, I'm Joel Haslam.